Hi, hi. This is the Echo Vision TV. My name is Temi Tokwe Okunu. Um, yes. Okay. This. <laughs> this is. Um, what do I even call it now? An organizer. You know? When you come to my office, sometimes you just see my barrel flying there, my scissors flying there, because I'm, I'm a hands on person. I work every day. I make sure that I, I mean, I do a lot of recycling, upcycling. I want to cut paper today. I want to cut um, bottle tomorrow. I want to make some pencil case. I want to do this. I want to do that. So my life is all about the scissors. It's all about the, um, the glue gun or this. It's all about the ruler. It's all about spirals, pins, and all of that. So I get to clutter my table. So guess what? All I needed to do was to get a board all of these um, pet, pet water bottles that I use every day, that you and I use every day, instead of you throwing into the gutter or throwing on the floor, even disposing illegally or indiscriminately, all you need to do is get those bottles, cut the head off, and glue it on the board. It gives you a very good organizer. Now, my scissors are in one place, my biros are in one place, my trimmings are in one place, my pencils, my ruler, my gum, my glue gum, you know, they're everywhere, every, now I can, I am a good organizer, I have everything in place, this is so beautiful, and I hope you try it as well, at home, please when you try anything, just, you know, hit me on, online, you know, comment, tell me what you have done, let me see it, I'll follow you right back, I want to show you how to make a pencil case, you can use the coke bottle all you need to do is wash it after washing you cut out the label you don't have to use the coke bottle alone so that they don't look like they are the only ones we have other pet bottles as well that that are all littered on the floor ragolis eva uh, eva water uh, which other one so many all the all of them they are all they all litter so it's not just coca-cola or fanta so you can choose to use any bottle at all but you need to wash it and make sure that it's dry the next thing you want to do is to measure the diameter so you get a measuring tape like this you can get anyone I love white so I use white a lot I love red as well you can see my lips and my nails so yeah. okay so you measure round what you want to the bottle you want to use you measure it round and Okay, by my measurement, this one says it is nine and a half inches. So, when you measure, the reason why you're measuring is because you would need a, a zip for your pencil case. You would need a zip. So, you measure your zip. Make sure it's nine and a half or ten. Okay, my zip is nine. It's too short. But we'll have to use it like that. Shebi is recycling. <laughs> okay, so we're just trying to give this bottle another life. We're trying to make sure that it doesn't end up in the landfill or in the dump site. It doesn't end up in the ocean. It doesn't end up in the dustbin. It doesn't end up in our drains. That's what we're just trying to do. And we are creatively doing this. Okay, so the next thing you want to get is your sharp knife sharp knife um, very useful to cut comes in very handy i use it a lot in my recycling lifestyle so you need your sharp knife you also need a scissors okay so let's just get on with it and you would also need a glue gun or you can use any kind of gum actually but i like to use my glue gun it's much more efficient and easy for me to use Okay, so I will need my glue gun later. So all I need to do is use my sharp knife to cut the bottle in two. Be careful. Sharp, be sharp. It's very sharp. You would need two of these. You have to be very careful because sharp is sharp. It's got a sharp knife. So it will cut you. Just have to be careful. So... Make sure you cut it round. Now this 
it's not going to be wasted as well i can use it for different things um all together all of your but nothing should be wasted i will need you to also show me how you're not wasting your pet, pet bottles i need to know thank you okay so i have an already cut um like i said need to wash it if it's not very dry make sure it's dry <laughs> okay so that's it we need just two and um the next thing you want to okay the scissors were supposed to trim it but i think i really i use my sharp knife very well so i don't really need to trim anymore so but if you really want the perfect finish trim it make sure that it's clean and smooth just to smoothen it off some people don't like the sharp knife so i think the scissors might just work well for you so that's what and that's all so all i need to do now is to open the zip and use my glue gun okay so this is how my glue gun looks like uh don't mind me i've been using it for years so um this is the gum this is the gun you know it looks like a pistol so that's why i call it a glue gun so you don't have to get this you can get your uhu you can you can use any other gum you know and um, it will work just fine so um you open your zip and then you put the gum round the edge of the plastic you have to be very fast so that it doesn't dry out on you if it dries out then you're on your own no you have to be very fast so once you're done Okay. Um, you're working on the down part so you make sure that um, the zip on your left hand side is the one you use underneath for the down part okay so we're done with that see and then you take the second part of the bottle you know we've used two bottles like that too. we have taken two bottles out of a trash can um, we are creatively reusing them or sustainably living well can teach our children this so so the other part the right part of the zip you put it on it and glue it fast so that it doesn't dry out like I said earlier voila you have your pencil case so you can put in your pencils open it wide for the pencils to go in yeah not just pencils though my rows as well if i put as many as possible and then you can reduce your clutter this way all you need to do is zip it back to space and that's your pencil case voila we have made use of this plastic two plastics actually we have stopped it from entering the ocean we have stopped it from clogging our drains we are living sustainably okay that will be all for today thank you so much guys for watching we want to live a sustainable life we're going to do this together do not forget to hit the like button. Please subscribe to my channel and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.